On October the 20th, hundreds of thousands of people marched through the streets of London, Glasgow and Belfast to demand a future that works. The march called for more economic and employment growth and an end to failing cuts. Today's march being organised by the TUC is to show total opposition of the people of this country to this government's attack on the welfare state, on workers in general, and basically the dismantling of society. What we're seeing in the CWU's view is an alliance between big business, the government and the media, um, and there's a land grab going on uh, to take the wealth of this country and place it in the hands of a few, and the rest of us will suffer. Well, I'm from the Liverpool district area, which covers the, the northwestern or the Merseyside area. My young son who's with me today is unemployed uh, and he's in and out of agency work. So for me, it's very important that we get youngsters now sorted rather than waiting for the future, which is what this government is asking us to do. We have things for our, for our members in, in the post office. We have government attacks. They think that selling off the post office is a good idea when really what they should be doing is investing in it. We have members in telecommunications and financial services who um, are interested in super fast broadband. It's going to be their livelihood in the future and we need investment in that. We need to secure their employment. Um, and of course, we have our members in financial services with things that are going on with banking and we're feeling very vulnerable and these are things that are out of their control. It's important that we actually do march against these austerity measures this government's brought in as major effects uh, for the whole of the country. And if you took our industry in itself, you look at telecommunications, uh, the, the cutbacks are it's there, the lack of infrastructure the investment uh, is going to be a real problem for, for us and our children in the future, especially in investment in broadband. So it's really important we, we've got a good turnout from CWU uh, and to fight this government. Um, from South Midlands Postal Branch, um, which is Northamptonshire, basically um, just marching for all the cuts that are happening um, around education, all the women's services that they're cutting, domestic violence services, it's just absolutely disgraceful, they're targeting all the, you know, the weak people, the people that need it the most, and most of all I'm marching here for my son's future because of all the cuts that are coming in now, that's who it's going to affect. The trade union movement is out in the streets today saying Government's uh, austerity measures are wrong, they're damaging, they're going to condemn millions of people to long-term poverty and we're saying enough is enough and this government must change. I just think it's going to get a lot worse. I don't think people can quantify quite where this is going and I think if people realise, I think there'd be a lot more people here today. I really do. Yeah, it's, it's a fantastic turnout today and I'm really pleased and proud of our, our people in the CW, but everybody in the trade union movement who's, who's you know, continuing the fight against this government's uh, terrible policy. Um, I'm here for a, a brighter future for the youngsters that are coming through. Um, I want to see them have education prospects. I want them to be able to have jobs to go into once they've finished their education. It's frightening for the future, really. Um, and, you know, that's my fear for Molly, really. She can't afford to go to university if that's what she chooses to do. Um, and it looks like she'll be living at home forever with mum, really. If the, if the cuts continue. <laughs> I'm here today to join with people from all walks of life, from all parts of this country who have come to this gathering today. And I, and I, and I tell you this, none of these people think that Britain owes them a living. None of these people are asking for the earth. Today is really good and everything, but it has got to go beyond this. There's kids' futures at front, the health service is going to be ruined. We need to pick up some momentum. David Cameron, Nick Clegg, forming a new boy band. No direction. Yeah, I came to this demonstration for two reasons today. One is the fact he probably ain't going to have a job in 10 years time and the second reason is there's a lot of people that work in Royal Mail and we're probably going to be sold off so we probably won't have jobs a lot of us guys next year so basically they're the two reasons I'm here today. Definitely I think we did make an impact today I think people will see how important it is for us but we're, not, we're just here representing our members and, and our society um, and I think everybody should have made an effort to come today and if they haven't to get involved in something in future at a local level, everyone can make a difference.